Welcome to the NCAA Tournament First Round Press Conference here with Christopher Newport uh, advancing to the second round with a 12-0 victory over John Jay. We're here with uh, fifth-year seniors Kareem Kulik, Emma Ritchie, and head coach Jamie Gunderson. Coach, can you just give us an opening statement about the, the win today? Yeah, it was, um, it was good to get back out to the field after, you know, losing in the fights last weekend. Um, then we can just to get the girls on the team, um, get going again. So it's a good mouth that game kind of thing. Try to save your voice a little bit. Go to the girls. Um, he just mentioned it's a bounce back game after a loss, something that you guys have never experienced before. Can you talk about what it was like all week in, in preparation for this game? Uh, yeah, so I just think we really prioritized having good energy throughout the week and just really focusing on uh, when we can improve and just ways we can be better as a team all together. Um, I think it was good knowing that we had another game coming right after that loss, just uh, just get better and honestly just come out stronger than how we left it. You talk about coming out strong, obviously you had the early goal, but then the three in the span of about a minute and a half. Um, what does that do for obviously, you know, team crowd spirit early going into the postseason game? Um, I think it was awesome, especially since we did have three different goal scorers in that time frame. Um, definitely a big moment for all of us um and to have it so early on into the game it definitely just raised our spirits and we just wanted to keep going and get more Corinne you're the only player that had two goals today you spread it around a record-breaking number of goal scores today can you talk about what it meant to be able to spread the ball around today um yeah overall it was just like what I said again just really improving coming back from last week and putting good energy out there. It was great that we had so many other different goal scorers as well, um, really boosting team morale, as you said. Coach, uh, can you talk about the depth and, and the ability to, to rest some of the starters here today? Yeah, no, it's great. Um, sorry. Um, but yeah, no, I think, again, I think it's 10 different goal scorers. We a lot of different goal scorers today. Um, I think that's just a testament to this group that we have. Um, no matter, you know, when we sell, people can step up and, and can finish over slash the starters or whatever. A, we can score from different areas. So that's really something that's special about this team is it's just the depth of. Uh, one last question about moving into tomorrow uh, for the ladies. Uh, obviously, you're playing at home. You get a chance to sleep in your own beds tonight. Uh, you'll be taking on either St. Mary's or Vassar. Um, I'm sure you'll be prepared for either one. But uh, can you talk about what it means to be able to be playing at home here one more time? Um, yeah, I think overall as a group, we're really appreciative to be at home. Um, it's just a great feeling overall. Like you said, to be able to sleep in our own beds and to just be playing at home on our beautiful field. I think, <clears throat> sorry, <laughs> um, I think we honestly can't ask for anything better or a better situation um, after traveling and being gone all last week. Um, to be back here and have our fans be on our own field, it just is amazing. Like, there's no better situation for us. So, definitely really excited. Today was a good game, but we're on to the next that's in the past and we're ready to go tomorrow. Coach, your thoughts on it as well? What are the two teams you have potentially based Yeah, on? I mean, Ambassador and St. Mary's both insights. Um, both, you know, the coaches play very well. Um, the beef is big, either one we face. But we could ask for a better opportunity to be playing at home and for our fans um, and get, we got there by what we did this season. So, we'll like, kind of this could. Well, congratulations again on the game one victory, and we'll see you out there tomorrow. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.